All right, guys. Uh, welcome to the unboxing. So, uh, yes, it's finally here. The Curve Christopher Bradley in stainless. So, hopefully this camera angle works for everybody. I'm not used to doing things in this way. So, let's see what we have in the box. So, I'm going to read this off camera right quick. Uh, hey there, you over on the Red Island. Greetings from the prairies. Enjoy the shave, brother. Cheers, Chris. So... There we go, the wonderfully personalized greeting card from Curve Shaving, and then the packing slip with my address on it. So you're not gonna get a look at that. Sorry, not happening. Black paper. And oh, what do we have here? The Christopher Bradley Stainless Steel. I don't think there's anything else in that box. So I'm just going to shove that out of the way for now. And I'll take a look in it when I'm done. But let's get a look inside here. Oh, another thank you card. You rock, Chris. Well, thank you, Chris. You rock as well. What else do we have in here? Oh, we got a curve sticker. Very nice. I did not get that one with the uh, with the brass. And then we have care instructions, I believe. Yes, care of stainless steel. I will have to read that with a magnifying glass at some point. And then attention, this just tells you about the little rubber spacer they put on here for transport that is not necessary at all for um, your daily shaves. I just, I took that off my brass. I just put it back in the box. That's in my top drawer in case I was ever to sell my curve. <laughs> That's not gonna happen, but I did have that. I save it just in case I did sell it and I wanted to, um, I wanted to a uh, package it up the way it came. So let's get in here and take a look at this weapon of whisker destruction. So as always the case, very tight fitting. And here we go. Wow. Look at that. Now that is a thing of beauty. The beautiful argyle handle went with the four inch handle because why not it's the same price as the smaller handles and I think this will fit my hand a lot better than the three and a half inch and just look at the machining on that what a beauty so we will take this apart that little rubber thingy put that in there and rest that on there Wow beautifully machined I'll have to take a very close look at this um, outside the camera apparently these are serialized I do believe so I'll see if I can't get a get a look at the serial number. Uh, this is the safety bar C plate. I went with the C plate um, for a change. And after the review video, which will be up um, a little bit later on this afternoon, I will also um, I'm thinking on doing a, um, a shootout between this and the uh, open comb B plate. And the reason for that is, according to the Carve website. Um, they say the open combs are a little bit more, a little bit more aggressive, and um, if you were looking to do an open comb, you would go down a plate size from what you would use for a, for a safety bar. So this is the perfect, the perfect setup. Safety bar C. In theory, the open comb B plate should be the same. Um, for me, my train of thought, I don't think open combs are more. 
are, uh, are more aggressive because aggressiveness just comes down to blade geometry anyway. Um, I don't think the open comb itself leads any to any more blade feel on the face. If anything, all the open comb does it just allows more lather to uh, stay on the face. So we will do an AB on that. But yeah, that is a thing of beauty. And get a look at the, uh, the engraving that's impeccable as always. Just a fine, fine piece of kit. Oh yeah, there might be a serial number up there, maybe, possibly. It's flipping around. I can't really see what I'm doing here, guys. So if everything's upside down, I do apologize. But uh, you've been with me long enough, you know how it goes. Wonderful. So let's put this together. See how it goes on the, on the threading. I will try very hard not to pooch this as I pooch it. Oh, very, very positive, very positive threading there. There's no grit, no grinding or anything. That is perfect. Absolutely perfect. Just look at that handle. Absolutely stunning. All right, guys, that is the quick unboxing. So um, this will be up now. Stay tuned later on today. You get a double upload from me, the Red Island Shaver. I will be doing the shave review with this. Can't wait, so I will see you later on in that video. Have a good one, guys. Ciao.